what's going on my low riders welcome back to my channel and welcome back for another vlog you guys i know it's been like a week y'all probably like what is my girl doing your girl has really been locking in this week on that studying so today is sunday again before i get into my sunday vlog don't forget to like comment and subscribe and we are headed off to church so you know just a daily vlog of what we got going on today i have filmed a little bit of what i did this week so i can put those clips in there possibly so we'll just see about that but yeah we're just gonna vlog it out for today i'm gonna study i'm gonna make a sunday dinner my mom is gonna come over and we are about to head to church first things first so i'll catch you back up with you guys maybe in the car or something so we are currently en route to church, you guys. There goes that boy Reese texting and driving. No, that's not good. That's why we gotta go to church because I, I gotta pray for my life dealing with somebody like that. Anyways, we definitely, like we woke up this morning and we were about to start watching it on the computer and I'm like, mm, no. We usually go to the first service. We are going to the second service today. But I'm like, since we up, we might as well just go. So once we leave church, we are going to go to the grocery store. I'm thinking about making collard greens, turkey necks, and my mom is gonna help me make some baked macaroni and cheese so that I don't ever need help again. Yeah, y'all know the routine. Like once you leave church, you go to the grocery store. I'm on the same type of time. So I'm gonna get there, go listen to the word. Then I'm gonna head to the store, the grocery store. Me and Reese both together forever y'all i took my quick weave out that fast because it was i don't know what happened this time it was a little i don't know i don't know i don't know it had to come out though so i got i be using wild grow in my hair to make it grow so it's a little oily and stuff yeah whatever it's gonna have to do what it do baby so yeah i'm talking a lot this morning that's interesting but for reals I take my test on Tuesday my gang so be sure to wish your girl some luck and I've studied that like I gotta keep studying keep studying but I'm, I, I feel real confident so that's good I'll catch up with y'all though for real when we leave church and we hit the grocery store possibly y'all keep God in your life yeah that's right stupid okay wow so this is how thick the park, the, the parking, the parking lot is. And Reese said that we need to park all the way back there. Look, baby. Look, we gonna record before it's time to come out. Yeah. No folks, look, it's like a, well, we are gonna show y'all when to get in here. It's like a Superdome. Yeah. It's like the State Farm Arena. <laughs> this thing get packed out. You got a little glitter on your face. That's so funny though, for real, because look, we know we ain't doing it this time. This is what he say is State Farm Arena. Yeah. But look, we walk into the sanctuary now. So we are out of church, you guys. Service was absolutely amazing. We had us a great time. Yeah. What are you going today? What did I learn today? Um, you aren't what you've done. You are what you overcome. Mm. Yeah. And I learned to not cut things that you can untie loosen yep i learned that too we bind and loosen that's right that's a really good word though um we are headed off to the grocery store now and yeah right yep. gotta make some sunday dinner have it you start the day good the day is gonna end great and you start the week off good the week is gonna end great so i know i'm gonna pass my real estate test and <laughs> All right, we are at the store. We need chicken broth. No, we still have cans. So now we're just gonna get the stuff that we need for dinner. And yeah, this should be real quick. He's getting snacks. We said we were literally getting only the stuff that we needed for dinner and like a few meats. And he was finna get some oatmeal cream pies and I seen it. What were you looking for? You love just, those. Yeah, but I just looked at it and touched it. I ain't eating them. I know you didn't get it, but you were about to. No what? I just wanted to touch it. Right. So now we gotta find turkey necks, collard greens, but we should be in the vicinity of all of this stuff. And it's cold in here, so we need to hurry up. All right, y'all, your girl is back home. And I have already started to prepare my collard greens, rinse them off, do all of that. I'm about to do the same thing with my turkey necks. And 
like you know clean them rinse them up do all of that probably season them for a little bit and yeah so i'm gonna post up my camera and get to it so now i'm about to start now i'm about to start cleaning my turkey necks i'm gonna bust them out the packs you know clean them first and then season them yep so i have finished cleaning my turkey necks now i'm about to season them um what is this tony's always gonna put my tony's y'all know that garlic powder it's a must if that tony's don't have you sneezing you ain't put enough always go in with my um what is this complete seasoning the bra straps are raggedy yuck mm, let me use that set yeah i gotta get all that seasoning in there you know don't play with it. Um, I don't like Lowry's for real. I feel like it's a little too salty. I don't know. I might put a pinch of it on there. My pepper. I'm a pepper type of girl. I love pepper. So I always put pepper on my sheet. Period. And I'm going to let these marinate for a little bit. Because it's still early in the day. You know? My wart... Worcestershire sauce, always. It give it flavor. Should have probably put it on first. Fuck. Whatever. It all do the same thing. You know? And let all these little baby marinate together. I don't like touching meat, so I always use one of these to stir stuff up. Or if I had gloves, I would use, you know, my hands. But I don't have any gloves today, so... So now I'm just stirring the seasoning up on my turkey necks to make sure they all, you know, are covered evenly tight. You know? So, yeah, these look pretty good. Look like it's going to be a bust. That's what I like. I actually have made this meal before, but when I made it the first time, I didn't record. And it was my first time making the meal, so I really didn't know, you know, how it was going to turn out. But it was bussing. The collard greens were my favorite. I didn't do that good on the mac and cheese, so my mom is going to help me with that. But other than that, your girl knows what she doing. For real. I'm making, I told one of my friends what I was making. She said, oh, you making a meal like my grandma and is. You know, we're the generation that be making pot roast at 20-something. You know, so... That's me definitely making some turkey necks with the baked mac and cheese, some collard greens with a little turkey neck meat in it, you know? And that's that. So let's see if I'm seasoned up. So my turkey necks are seasoned. I'm gonna let them marinate for a little bit too. And then I'm gonna hop on the greens. I'm gonna cook the turkey necks in the instant pot and I'm gonna put the greens on the actual stove. And so I'm gonna get those going, you know, soon. All right, y'all, I got my collard greens in the pot. They have been seasoned. My broth is seasoned to perfection. I browned my turkey necks, and now I'm going to let these cook for about two hours, maybe. Let's see. I done changed out of my church clothes. I have, um, you know, got my greens on and stuff. I just checked on them, actually. So I'm going to go check on them again in, like, 30 more minutes. They will have been on for an hour at that point. But in the meantime, in between time, your girl is studying look at my i need to be getting in the 90s but look at my practice scores like i need to be getting in the 90s but i've been doing pretty good did well the bottom one is the one that i recently took february 21st so yeah your girl might be on the path to greatness so i just took a break from studying i am about to check on the collard greens and get my turkey necks in my instant pot so let's see what the collard greens look like oh the smoke is smoking but mmm so, I'm going to let the turkey necks still just do what they do for a little bit. But they're probably, yeah, they're pretty tender and ready to start. I'm going to pull the meat off of the turkey neck. Oh, yeah. I'm going to pull the meat off of the turkey necks and then, you know, shred it and put it back in my greens. But I'm going to start getting my turkey necks ready. So, I got my turkey necks out. I am going to put them in my Instant Pot thing here. So I'll show y'all, I gotta put like a broth in here, you know, to cook it up with. And once I get everything in my, I will show y'all what it looks like once it gets in it. <laughs> my neck bones are in my Instant Pot. I got the bay leaves in there with like, I created this broth kind of with chicken broth. Um, Worcestershire, y'all know what I'm talking about. And I seasoned it 
And now I'm about to get it going. This thing is kind of heavy. So I'm just gonna place that in my little instant, instant. And shoot, let's see. I'll probably put this in here for, it's an instant pot, so it make your stuff good and tender real fast. But I'm thinking about putting it in here, maybe an hour and 30, two hours, an hour and 30. Let's see. Okay, so I put them on an hour and 35 minutes. The five minutes maybe should do a little one, two. I guess that means it's ready. So I'm going to leave that there and I'm about to finish studying. Oh, yeah. I put some devil eggs in my little egg maker. Devil eggs. I put some eggs in my egg maker to make devil eggs because devil eggs and collard greens are like a Mm, with some onions. I don't have no onions though. Yikes. Oh, yeah, I hear my mama. Don't play with me. Oh, yes. Don't play with my baby. Yeah. Cool. Purr. So, mom, I'm done with the collard greens. The turkey necks are still turkey necking. Right. And we're going to start the macaroni. All right. Sounds great. Cute. You look real cute, mom. Thank you, girl. Yeah. I felt like getting it together today. Period. That's my mama, don't put her. Please don't. I like that color. Show them your nails. You gotta show close, mom. And it's a nail tag. Yeah, don't go her. Is that enough water for my macaroni yet, right? Yeah, we just wanna make sure that the noodles are covered. Do you have a little oil, vegetable oil? Um, I have oil, I don't know if it's vegetable oil. Oh, it's extra virgin olive. So I got some. I got some. Like what about cook up oil? Oh, that's not cooking oil. You could cook with olive oil. oil. Yeah. So with I got this, some vegetable oil. Yeah, that's enough noodles. I got. Ve I do have vegetable oil. So if you want to add a little more noodles to it, do you think we need to? Right. That doesn't look like a lot. It don't. But you know they're gonna swell. Oh right. I mean, I let my noodles boil, and then we get into the nitty gritty of the macaroni. So while your noodles are boiling, cut my cheese. Mm -hmm. I came over here, y'all, to eat. Leave my plate on the table, right where I left it. Um, what else? My shoes. I just, I'ma just leave them in the middle of the floor. You know the stuff y'all do when you go to your mama house. I don't do that at your house. I don't leave my shoes in the middle of the floor, but I would I, all those years and leaving stuff in the floor, getting up, leaving your plate on the table. Yeah, I'm doing all of that today. Oh, really? All of it. Now I'm going to cut up my cheese, I guess. Yep, you're going to cut it into um, squares. Lots. Let's see how much. I think this is probably up. Eight, eight ounces. ounces. So we're gonna do half and half. Okay. In blocks, half and half of that. Okay. Last time I made um baked macaroni and cheese, I did not have half and half. I had butter and it was not too good. One hour? Mm-hmm. So they can fall off the bone. They've been in there for an hour and thirty. The macaroni still gotta bake for 45 minutes. 35. Same difference. Not one hour. Mm. Yeah, that should have had me a little snack. Oh, you couldn't have been waiting for <laughs> to eat when I need it. I yeah. have a snack. I don't have no snack. I went to the store today and I only got like meat stuff, you know, like stuff to make meals with for real. Mm -hmm. Because junk is junk and I need to be able to have have real food, you know? Be able to make a meal. Absolutely. You know? So I didn't get a lot of junk. And we love, we love leftovers. And do. Depending on what it is. Yeah, I'll, you don't even eat leftovers for real. Sometimes I eat leftover spaghetti. Okay. Um, Like that type of stuff, I'll eat leftovers. I don't eat no leftover fried chicken. I don't like leftover baked chicken. I'm a one and done type of person with that. Baked chicken be good the next day. I don't really care for it because I don't like how the meat tastes. Like sometimes, I don't know meat how this kind of with the chicken because if I bite into a chicken wing mm -hmm. and I have that taste, Over. I don't want nothing no what more. What is the taste? I can't describe it, but it don't. <laughs> it ain't right. <laughs> so and I and that happens a lot too. Yeah. In baked chicken, I get that for taste. You. So I don't eat that. 
You don't like baked chicken for real. I'll eat baked chicken, but if you get that taste, it's over. It, the, the taste, <clears throat> excuse me. <laughs> the, the taste come on the warm up. That's why I don't, ah. I don't do that. But I've had fried chicken that have that taste and off I rip, off the rip, and I won't eat it. I need to know what the taste is, mom. So now we just wait for the noodles to boil. Oh. I thought you cut the stove on. Why would I be cutting the stove on? You was boiling the noodles. Because you helped me put oil and stuff in it. And you stirred it up. What was you stirring? I don't know. I thought it was working. That's so irritating. I'm thinking it's doing something. Because you're talking about the noodles change colors because it's already in water. I'm thinking, yeah, the heat and all of that. Oh. It shouldn't take long for that to boil. No more than about seven minutes for that to boil. Once that boils, you know, you put your concoction together for your macaroni to go in the oven. I'm gonna start heating up my oven now. That's right, because I don't got, what, what, what's the temperature? 375, cause I ain't waiting on that. Where is it, 350? You tell me, macaroni baker. 375. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna go upstairs and take a break. Period. And this one like on YouTube, follow her channel. <laughs> yeah. Subscribe. I know y'all really want me to get a YouTube. What are you gonna do? But nothing. That's why I'm not getting one. Why? What do you mean nothing? You do nails. You can do nails. Yeah, I could do that. You could do like, like nail fills and nail tries and new vibes. Cause I just. Got nail mail in all week. All this past week, I've been getting nail mail. Yeah, all you do is order stuff. You need to start a YouTube channel for real. Yep, I, I should do a and haul. do reviews on like the products. Yep, because I just ordered some good nail shit. <laughs> I got all the new new stuff in. Oh uh, yeah, don't play with you. Don't ever play. <laughs> with me. All right, guys, we are done with the macaroni. We're about to get it in the um. Of it now, but let me show y'all what it looks like. Ooh. Hold on now. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ready for the oven. We changed the temperature to. Why is it so zoomed in? I don't know why that was zoomed in like that. We changed the temperature to 350 in the oven, and now we're gonna rock it out until it's ready and. We gonna show y'all when our plates is ready. The mac and cheese is done, guys. I just had to show y'all. But the rice is the only thing we are waiting for, and then we got to eat, baby. Here's my final plate. Don't play with me. My mom and Reese and I made their plate, and they are already smacking and clackling. Don't play with me. Look at that. Cheese is cheesing. Mmm. Mmm. I'm right now. And that's just that on that. The final result, you know, smashed. Don't play with me. I'm going to show y'all my mama and Reese play when they done so y'all can see the, you know, I did that. Okay, my mom is about to go, but. I I am, and I will say, even though we didn't have the Velveeta block cheese in there, that macaroni and cheese, that shit was slimming. All right. Ow. Ow. What did you think? Food was What was your favorite? Everything. Oh. Mine too, Reese. I like all of it. The mac, the greens, the deviled eggs, the mm -hmm. turkey, yeah. the mm. rice. Mm. That shit was slamming on 10 plus. Period. I know that's yeah, right. Mmm, a triple threat so is don't crazy. Play with her. Ooh. Ever. Yeah. I done cleaned up my kitchen. It's time for me to wrap it on up, honey. And, and I'm I, leaving the good and full. Look at them. <laughs> <laughs> and so I am going to get up on out of here. I got to study a little bit more for the night and edit this video so y'all can see it tonight. I love you guys and tune in for the next vlog. Be sure to wish me, you know, the best of luck because if not... <laughs> You won't get another vlog for like, I don't know how long. <laughs> Love you guys. See you soon.